633 right now and the countdown is on this morning. The Great Lakes Water Authority is expected to approve a major deal between the city of Detroit and surrounding counties. And it is a deal that will affect many of you. 7 Action News reporter Nima Shafe joins us now live from Campus Marshes. Nima, how many people are we talking about? Malcolm, we're talking about an estimated 4 million people between Wayne, Oakland, and Macomb counties in the city of Detroit by way of giving the Water Lakes Authority Board control over the city of Detroit's water and sewage department. Action News learning this morning that the 40-year, uh, the approval rather, of the 40-year lease would give the newly formed six-member board control over the current water system that's been controlled by the city of Detroit for upwards of 180 years. The deadline to approve the lease is Sunday, and with the board meeting later this morning, we're hearing the lease could be approved. Five of the six board members must vote yes for it to move forward. You may recall the Great Lakes Water Authority is is a board that actually was made up and created during the height of the Detroit bankruptcy. However, a gag order was placed on the proceedings, so nothing was known about it at that time. We do know that it's not been without controversy either. You may recall in its early formations, leaders from surrounding counties were concerned about the details of the agreement and just how much power they would have. But this morning we know they would have plenty of power, but still there are plenty of questions as well as to how it would benefit everyone. If approved, the city of Detroit will benefit by way of $50 million annually. Those lease payments that would total $50 million would go to the improvement of the city's failing water and sewage infrastructure. We also know that in its first year, the Water Authority Board will have an assistance fund to upwards of $4 million to help those struggling to pay their water bills. And if it's any consolation, so many people are wondering what will happen to my water rates. Well, at this point, we know the number of rates that customers have been seeing in the past will likely go down. However, the Water Board is warning this morning that should usage go down, rates will increase. We're live this morning in Detroit. I'm Mima Shafay, 7 Action News. Okay.